What's up guys, and I know I'm late, I'm so late on this review, man, I'm sorry that it took so long to get to it, but here we go, Wallace, the MVP Wallace, 6 foot tall, 95 speed, 91 catch, 87 release, 92 jump, 91 catch in traffic, 96 spectacular with the chemistry boost, 91 elusiveness, and 89 route running, does also have a 93 juke as well, which is pretty nice, which I'll show you later on. Now, the card that I was going to be comparing them to was the Super Bowl card, because it's not a huge difference, honestly, between those two cards. And this right here, man, the catching in traffic, just like his previous card, it's a 50-50 kind of thing. I mean, he's either going to catch it or he's going to drop it. I know that's not the best description for a card, but that's really how it is. I mean, if I throw it to him like 10 times, like the cover two, for example, he'll drop like five of them and catch five of them. So that's the best way to put it for him. And his route running was pretty much the same as well with his uh, previous card. So that's why this is not like the longest review because it's because there really was not a, a huge a noticeable difference and the same thing with the uh, release it really depends more on the corner than Wallace I mean if it's someone like 95 press it's not gonna happen but if it's someone like 84 press then expect a solid release and this video is what I was talking about before so many of these plays man yes I had a nice few catch tra uh, catches in traffic but I had just as many of these plays right here as well and look at this man he just flat out drops a wide open pass so believe me he will have his bad moments and as far as what he did best, man, he's still a great deep threat receiver. Not so much with, you know, the um, the aggressive catches, but just with the speed in general, man. Look at him just burn corners and safeties for big time yards, sometimes even touchdowns. And if you gave me this card and the Super Bowl card and told me to guess which one was which, I could not tell you. I mean, they're both so damn fast. Their speed difference is not that much, uh, uh, not that much different. And obviously, yes, if I had to choose one, of course I want to go with this one. I mean, you might as well go with the, the uh, faster version. And look at this Jew right here, man. So I'm, I'm telling you, he can definitely juke past people if you really want him to. So, is he worth getting? I would say yes. But do not pick up this Wallace if you're just going to turn him into a slot receiver. Only pick him up if you need a speedy guy. So, that's going to wrap this up, guys. And you see, his chemistry is a deep threat. But I think you could have made this guy a lot better. Like extremely more valuable if, if they would have gave him like the slot expert and the route runner chemistry can you imagine this mike wallace with the slot expert and the route runner chemistry you know and you got those chemistry boosted all the way to tier number two this man this card could have been something else but unfortunately that that's not the case but anyways guys is he worth getting like i said if you need a speedy guy i say go for it obviously i'm going to keep him for now because I, I need that that speedy deep threat but anyways guys my next review on offense will be the uh, running back thomas rawls and doug baldwin you see him right there on my team i, I just picked him up recently but anyways guys i'll see you boys for those reviews don't forget to like comment and subscribe see you boys later peace